guys welcome back to my channel thank you all so much for stopping by thank you so much for watching me um and i want to thank everyone who's been rocking with me um so far watching my vids don't forget if you are new here um and if you're a regular to like comment and then if you're new subscribe to my channel and um to you all who are viewing my video and you have not subscribed to my channel yet then what are you waiting for hmm? what you waiting for go ahead like comment and subscribe go ahead and hit that notification bell so you can get more videos in the future and go ahead and share this video so other people can see my video so other people can see my content and that way we can keep this channel going you feel me so yes um today is going to be my three thousand dollar collective haul Whew. three thousand dollars i literally spent three thousand dollars but yeah anyway so let's see what i spent it on a bit of shopping over the last few months um these are really technically 2021 purchases but since we're at the beginning of the new year um i wanted to show you all what i purchased towards the end of the year and there are some very recent purchases here as well like over the christmas holidays and then right around my birthday which was in november as well so let's just go ahead and jump into the pieces that i got i might as well just start my first item off with a bang another pair of gucci sneakers um and i forgot the name of these sneakers just a heads up i have already worn these i've worn them maybe twice already um like i don't even want to show y'all my little dust covers but if you look back to my old video you'll know what type of dust bag they come in the little satin gucci dust bags but i have worn these only twice and they're already that worn sneaker look oh so these are called the gucci ultra pace sneaker um and i believe they were 7.95 i'll get the exact price and i'll link it below in the description box as well um so 7.95 8 maybe 8.95 i'm not sure but around that area um but i love them if you can see like at nighttime they kind of have that reflective look on them um and then they have the little g symbol right there and then you can see the gucci written in kind of like a cursive type i love these and you can see i've worn them a couple of times but i love the neon bottom and then the two interlocking g's as well so i would say um these are probably my favorite gucci sneakers that i have they're really sturdy really heavy not flimsy at all that's something that i love about them they did come with like another they came with another lace which is like more of a cream color beige um lace that came with them so yeah, my next item that I got, I've shown y'all this in I think one of my Vlogmas videos, I actually unboxed it the moment that I got them in the vlog and um, yeah, showed them to y'all then. So if y'all watched that video, then y'all have already seen this sneaker. So, so it com comes in this box my box is dented but they are the jordan 11 cool cool gray sneaker i've worn them twice already now i actually got these off of sneakers.com and i believe these were 220 i'll put the price like definitely in the description box so all of my prices i'll list in the description box but these i do believe they were 220 so i got these off of sneakers.com the sneaker no 
I got off of the sneakers app and I actually got them as an early release or an early drop. I was, I thought I was gonna be on a waiting list, like an early waiting list. And no, your girl got them right then and there, paid for them, and then they shipped with, they came to me in like a week. But yes, I love these. I didn't have any highs. I tried for these and I really didn't think that I was gonna get them. Y'all know how it is on the sneakers app, but your girl got them. And she got them as an early release, period. So yes, these are those. Anyone who knows me knows that I love fragrances. Like I just really love fragrances. Like I cannot go into a department store without smelling some type of fragrance before I leave. Like I literally have to smell the entire counter before I leave. Well, this is not a department store fragrance that I got, um, but I did get this. If you can see it, I'm trying to get it in focus. Louis Vuitton Country Moi. Um, and you can see that just a little bit. The Country Moi. Oh my gosh. So Louis Vuitton fragrances come out like this. And they're really like their own little display stand. So you can see that. Like that. And you can take it out. And this is how the bottle looks as a whole. But if you want to sit it, like you can sit it on your counter like this. And it's its own display stand. You don't have to worry about it getting knocked over because it's like, it's really sturdy. But if you want to just put it on your fragrance display, just like this, you can do that as well. So that was an item that I bought. I really, really wanted this fragrance. Um, I had been wanting this fragrance for a long, long time. And then I just went into the store and just purchased it. Um, I purchased it along with my, um, it was a key card that I bought, um, a card holder that I bought. But I mean, y'all have seen the card holders. That's the only reason why I'm not going to show the card holder that I bought. But this bottle was $265. They're, all of their fragrances are $265. And then with tax, I think they're like, I think it's like $20 tax, $18, I'm not sure, but $280 something. So yeah, for the bottle, it comes to $280 something. But if you all think that that's a lot for a perfume, that's actually pretty darn good for a fragrance. Um, especially when you get into your high-end fragrances. And don't even, don't let me get on the niche fragrances or niche fragrances. Um, because those are a little more expensive as well. But yeah, it was just 265, 280 something with tax for this bottle. And the good thing about Louis Vuitton fragrances, if you um run out, they do have filling stations. So you could just look up online like which location have filling stations and you can refill your bottle. So that's pretty dope too. I wanted like a bag. I purchased this for my birthday. And I wanted, I just needed a really small bag. And I thought, I had been looking at this little bag for a while. Um, I had been looking at it over the summertime when I was going on this trip. Just something like really small and compact. So, I got this little Burberry pouch. And it is so stinking cute. You drawstring it like that. I took all my stuff out because I've been wearing it like crazy. Like, my son even was like, since you got that bag, that's all you wear <laughs> and do. <laughs> Period. So, yes, it drawstrings like that. And then you can wear it on your wrist like that. Um, or this is how I do mine. Um, really, like, in the pictures, they hold it. But I carry like a lot of stuff in mine. So better support, I will, for better support, I will take the drawstring down just a little bit. Like probably right there, not as close to the back. And then double the handle. So I'll pull the string from the other side and then pull this one and then that's how I pretty much wear it so this is a pouch so it's like a 
a backpack without the backpack straps kind of sort of if you want to think about it that way so it has this little pocket right here as well and it is an actual pocket that's there and then it zips and then that's the inside really so it's a, a nylon material um in the icon plaid print this was only 490 i believe it was for 490 so that wasn't bad for this item at all that was really really good and it was a really it was it's this bag is good for what i needed it for and i just i really wear it like almost every day as well get into the next item which are the shoes that i bought to go with them so it comes in this plain burberry box um and i just got these really really simple so i got these for my birthday as well like i told y'all my outfit was kind of like dressy casual i really um i had kind of like a dressy outfit on like a little bodysuit with this pleated skirt and um I dressed my outfit down with the bag and the shoes so you can see it has the um this is the traditional plaid not the icon plaid that was in the bag the traditional Burberry plaid and then it has the Burberry riding um and then these were $490 $480 or $490 for for these um they give me like that chuck taylor vibe but they're so cute they're so lightweight i got these in a size eight in women's i think they run on a bigger side a little bit like if they came in half sizes i would probably get a half size like maybe a seven and a half in women's and it'll probably fit snug like like a glove I'll say so even the Gucci shoes those were size 8 too so I um I pretty much get a size 8 in women for comfortability but in these shoes if they had half sizes I would go definitely go down in those was a sneaker app purchase as well um so I'll just pull them out and a lot of my shoes, I have already worn these, y'all. Because I'm not buying these shoes and I'm not wearing them. I'm not buying this stuff and I haven't worn it. Like my fragrance, you can see that I had used up some of that bottle. Like I have not bought this stuff and not worn it. But yes, these are the Nike Waffle Sakai's. So the Waffle Racer Sakai's. Um, these like really shocked me. I really wasn't going for this color. I got these off the sneaker app. I had been taking a lot of L's on the sneaker app. And then I was just like, I don't want this color, but I already know I'm going to take an L on them anyway. I joined the raffle for them, and I actually forgot that I had joined that raffle. So that Saturday when they came out, um, it was it said, you, you got them. <laughs> that was the notification. Your uh, selection, you were selected for the Nike Waffle Racer Sakai. And I was like, what? You lying. So I looked in the app and sure enough, I had them. They're really, really cute. They're kind of, they're really dope. They have the two-tone tongue. You can see it's a double tongue. Um, it's the gray and navy blue. It kind of ha it has the orange Nike check. And then um, it has the green tongue on the inside with the orange detailing as well. The black Nike sign. Or is that blue? No, that's black. And then um, I didn't really know that they were going to be like that see-through. And you can't really see. You can't tell on here. But it's a net. These are a net material. And then this Nike check is also reflective. Like, and you can't see that either. You can really only see that when... Um, oh, you can see the see-through a little bit. Like, you can see through to the other side right there but yes they're really cute they're really dope i love how they're constructed really dope and then the back it has the green um nike symbol at the back um yes and i've worn these maybe twice and it doesn't even look like it 
at all. Doesn't look like it. I love the speck detailing on the midsole. So dope, so dope. So they do come with the double shoe strings already in them, the gray and then the light gray or that cement color. Yeah, and then this Nike check is actually like a light blue and you could kind of see it reflecting just a little bit, but this one like really reflects, the dark blue really reflects. For 180 plus tax, and with the tax it came out to like two something. Over the Christmas holidays, you know how when you Christmas shopping and you end up buying something for yourself? Well, that's what I did, clearly. So I, I, I had been wanting this since I saw it. So I dropped into the MCM store and I bought their mask. And I think this mask is like so dope because I'm really not, I was not a huge fan of MCM at first then my sister kind of turned me on to them so i feel like the bags kind of copy off of louis vuitton a little bit but yeah so the mask i really love so it comes like this so when you put it on your face you'll put it on your face like this and then this goes to the back of your head and then you drawstring it to tighten it up, which really secures the mask on your face. I love that. And then for like an added bottle, bottle chick effect, um, you have this chain that's there and then you clip the chain on the little black loops that's on there, the little black loops that's linked to there and then let me just clip it and show y'all. I haven't, the chain has the MCM logo, the wording logo, and then you just clip it on there. Bam. Bam. So you could wear it, and then the chain will just dangle like that while the mask is on. And you can um, wear it on you can wear it dangling um like as an accessory you can wear it around your neck i really think it's meant to like be worn around your neck like a lanyard so that way when your mask is off it's just draped around you like a lanyard style um or like a um, necklace like accessory type situation but yes it's so so cute it will jazz up any outfit that you have on um is really just an uh, a bold added accessory like a, a really cute statement piece um and this was only like a hundred dollars so or it it was it was a hundred dollars i think 99 dollars so so then um i got these fendi shades i was looking for a pair of all black shades and when I saw these, I had to have them. So they look like this. And then they have the Fendi symbol on the sides. So you can see that Fendi right there. And then they are so, so badass on. And this is like the look that I was going for. Like they're come on just that fire sleek look real chill but kind of dressed up jazzy type look and then you have the symbol that's right there sleek and chic subtle but hey it's me it's your girl you feel me yeah a bold bold statement piece okay and these were four 30 for 80 um listen your girl gonna link it I'll, i'm gonna link it below i'm gonna link it below um but yes they were in that in the 400 area so i got these gucci socks and these are like the newer print socks so these were like more of the newer ones as you can see these have the shimmer so they're like really dressy casual type situation and and they went so perfect with these like so stinking perfect so perfect 
I love them. And I wear, th this is what I wore them with when I first got them. This is what I wore them with. I kind of wore them with like this this suit and kind of had this, the suit pant cuffed so you could see because it was like a skinny um, suit pant fit and I had them cuffed a little bit so you can see the Gucci socks peek through and then I had these on um, with them period your girl was fly period always you know and these were two Two twenty something, two twenty five, with tax included. And I got these from the Gucci, the Gucci store. My last item are these. Another sneakers app purchase. This was, I actually purchased these on my birthday. Yes, these came out on my birthday, November twenty first. And they're these. Aren't they so fly? They're so fly. I love the detail. Now, I'm not a huge silver person, but I love the silver in these. Like, I love the detailing effect. It's so nice. They look so expensive. The leather on these Jordans are a really nice, nice leather. Um... And the silver detailing, like, look at the detailing. It's kind of like that bubble. The symbol is the bubble effect. And then um, it's that silver color, like the same silver color that's in the, the Nike check. But, yes, I love these. They are so, 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 so cute. And I worn these once. They really weren't how I wanted to wear them. So, and it was just like a quick run to the store, but like, so I don't really consider that my first outfit, but like my first outfit in these, like, your girl gonna be fly. And I'm gonna have to take a picture. I'm gonna have to take a picture and show y'all. But yes, I love these. I wore these once. You really can't tell. You can't really tell. Jordan 1 highs and uh, yes, the burgundies. And they are so uh, freaking dope. Okay, so I actually got these in a um, Big Kids six and a half. So I only paid one thirty for these sneakers. So that was not a lot at all that I paid. And I got these after the sneaker app. Okay, guys. So uh, yes, that's it. So this is my three thousand dollar collective haul. Um, of everything that I got over the past few months um i hope you guys enjoy watching this video as much as i enjoy making this video this was super dope to make um and to really just see how much i spend um how much i spend on the items that i get like it was really 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 cool to see just how much i've been spending <laughs> lately so yes Guys, if you really enjoyed this video, which I hope you did, then please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share your girl video. And also hit that notification bell so you can see what other videos I have coming up because I do have some things in the works and I do have some things coming. You feel me? So check your girl out. And until next time.